Hey girl, it's Emily. I'm so pumped to bring you a new program that's been long overdue and that you all have been asking for. Think habit-based fitness to help you stay consistent with a workout routine made with you in mind and for whatever season of life that you're in. I'm talking progressive overload, metabolic conditioning that won't wreck your hormones, and workouts that support your body and mind. I'm so excited to bring you the new Training for Life app launching September 30th. Now, what makes this program so unique is in addition to my eight plus years of being a fitness instructor and coaching hundreds of women, I'm also putting my expertise as a behavior change specialist in this program and including my very best habit strategies to ensure you stick with the program. So get on the wait list to be the first to hear about the launch of the Training for Life app on September 30th and join us for a fun 21 day sweater weather challenge to help you get started. Just go to BI it.ly slash training for life. It's also linked in the show notes for you. I'm so excited for this. Now let's get into the show. Hey girl, do you wish you could make your healthy habits stick, but life keeps getting in the way? Are you tired of diet culture telling you to shrink yourself when you'd rather just find true food freedom, move your body for joy and feel and look good in your favorite leggings? then you're in the right place. Think of this as Atomic Habits for Women. Hey, I'm Emily Nichols, habit and fitness coach, millennial mom, and Taco Tuesday enthusiast. I'm here to tell you there is an easier way than what we've been taught about health and our habits. How do I know? Because I've gone from former chronic dieter to habit hacker through the power of this system that I'm now going to teach you so you can finally stop dieting and just train for life via your habits. Remember, it's not your fault your healthy habits haven't stuck. We just have to do them differently. Are you ready to habit hack your health? Then let's do this. Hey girl, welcome back to the show. We're back to our training for life series and anticipation of the new training for life app launching on September 30th. Now we've already chatted about our diet culture origin stories and how to unravel that so we can train for life instead. We've talked a little bit about habit-based fitness and what that means and how you can stay consistent, which is our number one challenge. And today I thought I would just get a little more personal and vulnerable with you and talk about my own body image struggles. But before I do that, just a reminder, the app is launching this September 30th. September 30th, and we're going to kick it off with a 21-day sweater weather (laughs) challenge. So this is a 21-day habit-based fitness program with some bonus habit trainings, trackers, private podcast feeds, all around habit hacking during fall festivities, changing schedules, seasonal treats. We'll do some live workouts, group calls for added accountability. And this is just a great challenge for you to build momentum and get to do like a try on of my coaching style um, before you become a member. We'll also do a giveaway for a one-on-one mentorship from me as far as customized habit loops, habit training, all the things. So go to bit.ly slash training for life to get on the wait list and be the first to hear about this new habit-based fitness program coming for you. It's linked in the show notes. Now, I've been a group fitness instructor since 2016. And I know, I know this is where I have personal, where I personally shine. And I have such a passion for helping people transform their mindset via fitness. I feel very called to serve in this way and have been doing so since 2016. I've taught insanity boot camp. Cycle bar, spinning classes, TRX. I currently teach at Orange Theory, and I recently just got my yoga teacher training, which, P.S., there will be some yoga flows on the app. I'm so excited for that. I dug super deep into habit coaching after being a group fitness instructor and seeing there was such a gap between women actually doing their workouts consistently and actually living their life, too. And because... Because of that, I pivoted my podcast and I became a Bay Behavior Change Specialist. So this is just a a unique combination of a habit coach and a fitness coach, especially for modern moms like us to actually make working out training for life. It's a lifestyle, right? So I'm out there, right? Literally on stage teaching fitness. I always joke the first time I put on my mic, I felt like Britney Spears, like circa like 2000. 
thousand, right? I'm literally on stage with a mic teaching fitness. I'm bringing this energy and good vibes to add to the experience of whatever type of fitness format you're doing with me. We're talking about correct form and helping folks connect to themselves and feeling their most confident, helping them train for life. Like, ugh, I love it so much. But as I was doing this, as I was on stage, I wasn't feeling my most confident. In all honesty, I don't know if you feel like this too if you're my age. Sometimes I forget like that I'm 43 now and I'm teaching with other instructors who are younger than me, which is silly because I got the experience, right? But I still notice at times like, oh, these kids, like these kids, like some of them are like 20 years younger than me, okay? Like 15, 20 years younger than me. I don't want to make myself feel like more old than what I am. <laughs> But sometimes that leads to some insecurities in my own mind. Like, gosh, like, are people going to want to actually, like, take my classes? They think I'm, like, old now. Or I compare myself to the way I looked years ago before hitting my 40s. And honestly, going through the HotWorks virtual instructor process messed with my self-confidence big time. And, and after conversations with folks, with people who were from that world behind the scenes, I've come to realize it totally wasn't the right path due to behind the scenes stuff not focused on body positivity. And I've done virtual fitness. I coached a ton during 2020 and did virtual fitness. And I've put some free workouts out there. It's linked in the freebie section of the show notes. I even have a virtual coaching specialization, like an actual certification in this as well. And as I've met with one-on-one -on -one habit coaching clients, and we've talked about their fitness habits they weren't following a program or one that was meant for them. And I, this has happened for years and I kept being like, oh, well try this or try that or there's some workouts on YouTube or come join a class with me if you're local and we can take class together. And I don't feel like I was helping people to the best of my ability. I've always had it in the back of my mind to put out something there with this habit-based fitness approach specifically for someone like you. So here we are. I'm pushing myself and my own self-limiting beliefs to the side because I was like, well, I need to look a certain way. I need to sound a certain way. Maybe I'm, you know, aged out from teaching group fitness virtually, which is so silly because I know I really shine when it comes to teaching fitness and paired with my habit coaching. Why shouldn't I? Why wouldn't I put out the new Training for Life app? And my opinion, it would be selfish of me not to share this gift and serve other women in this capacity, no matter if I'm thinking like, oh my gosh, look at my rolls, or maybe, you know, if I'm wearing lighty, lighter leggings, like lighter colored leggings, you can see my cellulite through my leggings, or, you know, am I, am I using my own good form, or should I be lifting heavier to encourage other people, but I couldn't lift this one certain weight. I'm pushing all that aside, right? I'm a real human being and you are too. And this is training for life together. So, and it was so funny, you know, as I was finishing up the notes for this episode, it just reinforces to me so much that sharing my failures and insecurities can help you as well. This member actually just posted this and it was just perfect timing. Like, God's really looking out for me sometimes. And she said, huge shout out to Coach Emily. From all of the quotes of the day, being a su supportive transformation challenge coach, supporting me through two pregnancies while working out, she's always intentional and meets you where you're at. I'm also inspired by not only how she motivates us, but she motivates herself chasing dreams and never quitting when things don't go her way. We love you, Coach Emily. Ugh, I'm going to cry. Like, that means so much to me, you guys. And I do share my failures, maybe not um, as transparent sometimes or the way I'm feeling about my own insecurities, but I, I just really feel called to do this. And I really just wanted to come on here and just be vulnerable with you. And hopefully you can see and feel my heart for teaching fitness and being able to reach more ladies at this level. I'm just so excited and so honored to be able to do that. And I know I can help make you feel something with this new program. And I can't wait to share more with you. And I just want to thank you. Thank you for letting me be vulnerable. <laughs> and thank you for being patient with me as I've been figuring this out the best way I could serve you in, in your training for life journey. Like, girl, 
this is it. This new Training for Life app is it, and I can't wait for you to join us. So remember, you can go get on the wait list at bit.ly slash training for life. I'll announce there first when you can sign up for the 21 day challenge and how you can start accessing the 12 week program, the entire member library, which will always be growing, which is so exciting. And that's what's exciting about becoming a member too. You'll be, I'll be asking you in our community there, which is PS off of social media. Love that. I'll be asking your feedback, like what kind of classes do you want to see? Do you need this? Do you need that? And it'll just, the library will keep continuing to grow and you'll always have access to it, which is super cool. So I can't wait. Thank you so much for letting me share my heart with you and being vulnerable today. I love you big time and I'll see you on the next episode. Hey girl, real quick before you go, if you are ready to take action in creating your own habit loops, then I wanna invite you to take the three-day habit loop bootcamp email challenge. You'll learn how to create your own cue, routine, and reward from that Atomic Habits for Women philosophy that we've shared here on the show. And oh, it's also available audio only too, so you can take it on the go while your mom Ubering around town. Just go to bit.ly slash habit loop boot camp. It's linked in the show notes as well to start taking action now. And if you love the show, the biggest way you can support me and other mamas like you is to leave a quick written review so we can help more mamas stop dieting and start training for life via habit hacking. Love and appreciate you.